Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play Diablo 2 Resurrected where we are going to try to find sewers from the Cross Bazaar and my information is that we can enter the sewers from here. So let's get the wrong weapon by the way. So let's get into it. We I skipped one part of the world here in the off because, well, wanted to make it a little bit quicker. And we do not have... I'm currently at the point, I know, I oftentimes said I do want to have everything in the let's play and I'm technically still behind that, but sometimes... I don't want to make the videos too too long often times. Anyways, Star Touch the Dark, that's a nice name. So he's gone. And yes, we have a level up and I haven't assigned the skill points as of yet. Shame on me. Oh man, how many of them are they? Ah, there, sorry. Blade, mana portion, score identify. Did they not? Okay, healing portion. I could have sworn there was something else. Got it, healing portion, got it. Come on, boys, go at them. Oh boys, okay, these guys are mages, okay, good to know. I'm just gonna, ooh, okay, cracked morning stars, not interested. Are they? Okay, they are just lightning based, okay. I was wondering if they're, whether they might fi uh, fire with fire, you know? But no, they don't. Okay, fair enough. Oh, come on. What do we have here? The ruined temple. This is not where we're gonna... Where we need to be, right? Wait a second. Kuzat Kuras Bazaar, then the ruined temple is something different. At least so I think. Viper Slime the Unholy. I have to tell you something, the names in this game are absolutely amazing. Come on, drop something nice, please. Okay, actually, practically not really. Gold, thank you. Oh, hello. Already, okay. There is a lot of tr um, health portions which are dropped here. Let me large has three. I will be back in a second. Alrighty, it goes on. On the hunt for not only the waypoint, but for the sewers as well. So let us uncover this part. I know the... It's gonna be the separator. The water line is the separator. I am quite certain of that. Let me actually check. Are we already here at the sewers? That would be... Obviously, absolutely amazing. Hello, full helmet. Okay, the sewers level one. So let's bloody enter. Oh, those nice memories. We don't need this is probably a dead end. 
Oh, hello. Could you please come over, you guys? Okay, stash. A ring always much appreciated. So I, I am utterly not certain how many levels there are. But level one means at least two. Hello, skull pile. Oh, very, very satisfying to kill them feeders, I have to say. A giant sword. Come on, you boys. Oh, I didn't even know that the Horadrum Ancients were in the third act too high. I was utterly certain that they were only in Act 2. Well... Okay, our shoes are slowly but steadily breaking apart. I hope that they are repairable. This is just what I... I, don't, I think I never understood that in... Did I? And so it goes on. And of course they didn't. I would say more the middle. More the middle the way to the next level is. But since this is absolutely randomly generated. I obviously can't tell. Yeah. Hello, chest, chest. I'm not gonna bother with down there since this is definitely gonna be a dead end. Okay, level. The way to the next level found. Here we are, opening up this one, this one. Woo! Give me the gold, thank you. Crack battle axe, fair enough. Or is it the way up? Don't tell me. To upper Kuras, that ain't it. Okay, and there I was looking forward. But at least we know that this is then gonna... If we have... I think we need to go to Upper Kuras. I guess there's gonna be a quest for that. And one point. Or do we just have it here? No. Therefore, I, for a small second, I was really, really happy. Oh, healing portion, well, well, well. I did not expect the sewers here to be as big as they are. We did not have enough place to to upper Kuras to um, attack him. All so I would still say more to the middle than the surroundings, if that makes any sort of sense. And these guys I should not face alone. They do damage, especially in the groups there are, but. Even more, they hold up a lot of damage where I am not able to take them down at all. Oh, 
Okay, I think to be if I'm smart, I'm going to take the other way around this one. Just to be certain to find. Okay, okay, okay. Fall back, boy. Fall back. We are gonna need all of our friends here. Especially because there is not a champion but a named character, which of course is nasty. Spine Spell, that's a nice name. I am overburdened. Okay. Why? Okay, th that's why I am overburdened. This inventory, man. This inventory. Cannot but, but um, understand still. I mean, I, I did already tell that I had a not discussion, but I talked with one guy. It was a, you know, it's a German video game magazine, game style it's called. And there was a, because I think after the alpha version they did some, there was a video on on Diablo Resurrected um, first impression style and the guy who made the video said something like, yeah, the inventory is too small, it's um, hideous. And there was one guy in the, com in the comments telling um, that it would absolutely break the end game. And I understand it, because the end game, what I mean, is them charms, right? But in the end, you could have done a extra, this is just my five cents, an extra inventory for the charms, where you would say they pick up a certain amount of inventory. Uh, I don't know. It's, I still think the inventory is absolutely way too small. I mean, probably I'm having too, too many charms in the, in the, uh, too, too many in the inventory, but I don't know. I don't have a good solution except making the inventory bigger, but still I understand the point a little bit that it would break the end game, maybe, but you could have found a solution there, whether restricting the amount of charms for example I somehow that makes for me sense but I don't know I'm not I played the game a couple of times through but the real end game I would say is a little kiddo I have not been in so maybe I'm gonna make it this time and maybe then I'm having a solution for that okay down it goes. Level 2 I, of course, went in the wrong direction, as usual. But at least now, here I'm not going to be confused by going up to the upper. This is hard. That was, well, a little bit of a bummer. So let's head back to city. First of all, we are gonna get healed and everything. Hello. Good day. And we have a little talk. You have found Kalim's heart, and it still bears the courage to face Mephisto. Place it in the Herodric cube along with Kalim's other relics. The eye, the brain, and the flail. And the flail. Yes, this one we do not have. It pains me to waste time with you, so I'll get right to the point. There is a very special book which you must find for me. It was written long ago by a sage known as Lam Essen, who studied Skatsimi magic and the effects of the prime evils on the mortal world. The black book was lost when the children of Zakarum took over this land. Now you must reclaim it without delay. Its knowledge may aid us in this dark time ahead. Okay, and that means we have a new quest, and that is search the six temples in the bazaar, upper cross, and the caseway for Lum Essence Tome. Okay, that's good. So we need to search for Kalim's Flail and Travinkle. Beware the High Council. But that right now brings us actually already to the end of this episode, you guys. If you 
actually do who's actually repairing my I stuff okay i know who if you actually do have enjoyed this episode you guys then please give me a teensy little a thumbs up and subscribe and hopefully and hopefully i see you in the i'm just wondering where our weapons are but in the next episode until then have a wonderful day